Two Minute Maths Addition without carrying Learning intention, you will be able to solve column addition problems that don't need carrying. You need to know how to add two digits together that sum to less than ten. Steps are, number one, start with the column on the right. Two, add the digits and write the number below the line. Three, move one column to the left. Add the digits until there are none left. It's an easy algorithm to use as long as you remember uh, to keep your columns aligned and to respect place value. So I start with the rightmost column, which in this case is the units column. 3 plus 5 is 8. I move to the next leftmost column, which is the tens column, and I add 9 plus 0, which is 9. Here's another example. I start with the rightmost column, 2 plus 1, I add the digits together and get 3. I move to the next leftmost column, which is the tens column, 2 plus 3 is 5. Easy. Once you get the hang of it, it doesn't really matter how many numbers are in the, uh, how many digits are in the numbers. Um, there's no carrying over anyway, so it's it's just a matter of adding the two digits together and moving left. So let's do that. Six plus three is nine. One plus two is three. Four plus four is eight, and so. On. I just want to point out one thing about the first step, which is to start with the rightmost column. Now, most students will say. Um, to start with the units column, uh, which is correct if the rightmost column is a units column, but in the case of a sum where you've got decimal numbers, the rightmost column is actually the first place in the decimal number. So it's correct to say start with the rightmost column, not start in the units column. So here I'll go uh, start in the rightmost column, which is the tenths column. Okay, 7 plus 1 is 8. Insert a decimal place. 4 plus 4 is 8. 8 plus 1 is 9. The answer is 98.8. To practice, create your own sums choosing numbers that will sum to less than 10 and check your answers with a calculator.